Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Simpsons Hit and Run. Alright. And, uh, apparently we can damage, we can fix damaged cars for ten coins. That's not bad. It actually makes sense if you've got a car that's pretty badly damaged, like for ten coins, you could just smash it up and then get it back out of the the phone with with that. So anyway, we want this car because we're gonna do a race. So. Hi, Mr. Lisa. Hi, Mr. You Lisa. The will give you I guess we're kind of Mr. Bring Lisa. It. I don't know. I mean. So anyway, so this is our checkpoint race. It's uh, race three for the level, but uh, it's the first one we've done. Where is it? Is there already one of these? Five, five, four. I'll have to check. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, checkpoint race. Pretty basic stuff, don't come in last. This one will be a little odder, odder because we really haven't been playing around in this level too much to kind of know what's going on, so. So anyway, so we're Bart, and this is, this is obviously, again, Bart's signature car, and, uh, the stats say that the handling on this thing is, uh, is amazing and actually I, I don't know I mean it's all right it doesn't it doesn't seem incredibly spectacular to me I mean it looks like a, a rocket launcher and it's obviously it's that soapbox racer from the soapbox derby episode cheated, but, uh, it really looks like it should go yes, faster than it does totally but, awesome. I mean it's no rocket car oh, from on. outside the gold house or whatever I actually watched that episode yet uh, today on DVD it's uh it's kind of fun Oh, nice jump there. All right, man, that guy's way ahead of us. Yeah, we completely failed that. We can do better than that. Well, that's apparently the end right up there. We'll get there. We're gonna make this work. You know, again, sometimes this is just the the standard, I guess, is things over and over and over again until they get done. So. Yeah, I totally rule. So you'll probably be seeing some of the last attempts, and maybe even this attempted fast forward, because, you know, I mean, it doesn't make any sense to, to put you through all that stuff, so. But that allows me to tape a little longer, at least, uh, before kind of signing off or whatever. So. Alright, we're in good shape now. Are we in second? So we were in second there briefly. I didn't even see the other car. See, I don't know. Some of the the hit detection on this is a little weird sometimes. But it seems like we got a good lead. I mean, we're not making any major mistakes or anything. I should shut my mouth because we very easily could. All right. I guess I'm still in good shape. Got this crazy turn to take. All right, and our finish line. Hooray! And the crowd goes yep, that was our wild. first race. Okay, one of three races completed. Well, good. All right. All right, and uh, we're back. I, uh, had to do some weird stuff with files there, so I will, uh, I'll definitely cut that out because that took way too long. So anyway, so we're back in level two, uh, even though, um, we never really left it. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to, uh, to run over here and talk to Grandpa, and this will be our bonus mission. From the war. The war. So. What is the Kaiser at it again? I'll teach him. He stole my best girl and my best box of saltwater taffy. <laughs> Grandpa, Kaiser stole his sense. best box of saltwater taffy. My blood. How could I honestly? How could Grandpa be a World War One vet? I mean, that would make him like a hundred and twenty-seven or something. I mean, it's not. Fine by me. In fact, I think as I, as I say this, I don't think that I I know that there aren't any World War One vets left alive in America. Uh, there may be in Canada or Britain, but so anyway, so our first bag of blood is right over here, so that's easy. And uh, I'm not exactly sure where we're going for the next one. 
Well, gee, we should have just went down the other way. That was a waste of time. We gotta go to Moe's. I'm not even very sure where Moe's is. Well, oh, that was wrong. It's a left turn. Dummy. I'm gonna try to not call myself profane things anymore. I mean, like, I don't deserve that. I'm a nice guy. I treat myself alright. Well, that was a... You know, it's... Although I would have rather, you know, gotten the fine and passed the mission. So anyway, should I start talking slow again like I did in that other video? Or am I like, hello? Uh, probably not. What I should do is, like, I should try to sing something in slow motion. Like, I should try to, like, like Chantilly Lace. I'm gonna say hello, I'm gonna be, hello, baby. Gently lace and a pretty face. So. Now that I've done that, I probably will pass this mission and I won't ever be the chance to use that. I should do it just as like a... I should, I should do that just for fun. So, just, just one time, just record my voice and like, run it through this stupid thing and like, jump it up and see if I can make a really cool chipmunk style kind of, kind of thing. Yeah. yeah, 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 you have any human blood and goat blood, blood and Bart sure, doesn't care. It's just, you know, this comment, it's, it, this commentary is having a hard time staying out of really morbid spaces. I <laughs> like goat blood. We can start talking about satanic ritual abuse. Dust, dust like in the satanic ritual abuse craze of the 80s. Like, if anybody wants to talk about obscure social phenomenon that nobody ever thinks about anymore. Maybe people think about that, I don't know. Like, I don't know who would be thinking about that, except for, I guess, sociologists or something. Oh, oh, that was the yeah, we might as well park this vehicle Time facing back the way we're coming, because it just makes sense. Alright, squeaky voice team. You have any blood? Would you like fries with that? that doesn't even make any sense. Why would we come here for blood? I mean, like... I guess it's kind of like crusty burger, but like, this is the you know, do you have, do you have blood? Yeah, you want fries with that? That's so crazy. Wow, oh, we're over 15 minutes. Well, when we finally get this finished, we'll uh, we'll cut the video off. That'll make sense. Hopefully, this is it. This would be nice if we could just finish this up and get on with the rest of the game. Oh, whatever, this is worth it for a vehicle. I mean, the one bonus mission, it's worth doing early just to get the vehicle. Because, like I said, you know, these vehicles all have different stats, and they might, you know, be handy in races, or, you know, the more strategy options we have later on for missions, you know? So. This is too cool for school. So, like, oh, we're gonna make it. Oh, we're so gonna, we got it. Awesome. This better be the end of the mission. Better not have us run around for other stuff. All right, there we go. Is that enough? I need another car. Take it. Okay, he's gonna give us our our, our car. All right, guys, that's it. And we're gonna be cutting off this tape, and uh, I'll talk to you next time, you guys. Thanks for watching. You take.